So now that we've got our scarlet screen and our gray screen, let's actually set up some navigation between those two. And to do that, we'll actually be working inside of our index.js file, so app slash index.js. And beyond our basic imports here, we're going to be importing router and scene from React Native Router Flux. And then uh, another thing we'll need is to actually import Scarlet Screen and Gray Screen, since those will be our routes. And we're using this index.js to kind of define our actual routes up front. OK, cool. So we've got that set up. Now, we're not going to be using any of this, so we can just go ahead and delete all of that. I'll go ahead and delete the imports as well. So when you're using React Native Router Flux, the top level component that you're actually going to be returning is the router component. And that's just the way this package actually works. And then within the router, we'll set up a scene. And this, this is going to be our root scene. And with that, we'll actually give it the key of root. Again, this is just kind of the convention and the way this package actually works. So now that we've got those set up, is when we're actually going to start rendering our scenes, the, the components of our app. So again, everything in React Native Router is a scene. So we'll go ahead and set up a new one, add a little bit of spacing so it's easier to see. And first thing, we're, we're going, to, going to be doing the three required props on any component you add when using uh, React Native Router Flux. So first up is the key, and this is what we're going to use, uh, as I showed earlier, with the actions to actually navigate between the screens. So since this one's going to be Scarlet, we'll just go ahead and give that the key of Scarlet component. This is going to be the component that we actually render. Scarlet screen. And then finally, we'll just give this a title and we'll say Scarlet. Okay, so that's easy enough. And we're going to do the exact same thing for our gray screen. And then one final thing I want to do here, just so it actually shows up, is say initial. Um, and this is just shorthand for saying initial true. And that means that this component will be the first one that's actually returned. So now that we've got that, let's save it and see what happens over in our simulator. Cool. So we can see that we've got um, our Scarlet screen is showing up, and we've got a nav bar that says Scarlet up there, which is pulling from our title. Okay, so now that we've got our screen, let's we, we want to actually be able to navigate to, in this case, our gray screen. So what I'm going to do here is jump over to the scarlet screen. And earlier on, we imported actions from React Native Router Flux. And that's what I was talking about before, where an action is going to be how we actually navigate between screens and the way we know which screen we want to go to is based off of this key property. So what we'll do is hop over to this text component and we'll use an on press pass in a function. We're going to say actions dot and what we do here is actually add in our the key that we want to go to. The key being um, the key that was specified in this scene. So in this case, from our scarlet screen, we want to go to our gray screen. So we'll replace this with gray. And just to do a, do this ahead of time, we're also going to add the same thing here for on our gray screen. We'll allow it so whenever you click the gray screen text, it'll actually go to the scarlet. That way we can have some nice um, nesting within our routes. So we went ahead and saved those. Now we can see when we click red screen or scarlet screen, it'll go to gray and so on and so forth forever and ever as long as we want to press that. Then up here in the nav bar, we can see that we've got um, our back button, which will go back and back and back until we're at the top of our stack where there's only one route in our navigation stack. In our navigation stack. 
Um, so you can see here, this is the most basic way to use React Native Router Flux, where you're just uh, navigating through a, a, uh, like an array of routes.